Really, we're starting at the, at the genesis of bringing two agencies together, MEC and Maxis, and the idea being, let's really reboot and redesign what a modern marketing agency is, with a single focus on consumer journey, and with that, understanding how we can grow our clients' uh, revenues and opportunities in the marketplace. So this focus on client growth, which is more and more the, the big demand that all of the CMOs are facing in a world of great complexity, feels like it needs our energy and focus as well in thinking about our tools, approaches, talent, where to invest, and where to help them drive that next opportunity. So it sounds almost like a, a, as much as a consulting engagement as a buying uh, um, strategy shop, or tell us, tell us sort of yeah. how you sort of... Interesting you observation, because uh, I think you're right. That's the, the future of the agency business is definitely shifted to not just a buying on impressions and cheapest CPM and fill out the pricing template. Certainly there's a component still of investment management that's all about driving efficiency. But as you think about our role today in the middle of the ecosystem and having to not only understand and embrace and evolve our clients' approach to data, but also to their broader business issues. And so we see an opportunity in how do we get a greater share of their problems and a greater share of solutions that we can deliver that solve those challenges around growth, solve the challenges around driving greater efficiency. And here at CES, help them understand how to navigate this new landscape and think about the role innovation can play in a scalable way, in a way that helps transform their business, or in some cases, helps them catch up to the other digital disruptors. So. How has advertising changed? What do they expect from you guys and expect from your uh, the creative agencies? And how have the demands changed and you know the opportunities changed? With this laser focus on consumer understanding, not only from a purchase journey lens, but how are they adapting and adopting to the, the breadth of content they have, um, the breadth of distribution opportunities, the ways to connect. Our role is really sifting through all of that to find out what's most meaningful and relevant to their consumers and what's the brand relationship that can be established with those insights. So much of it, you know, it's not an a innovation play so much anymore or understanding what the next platform is, the next channel, the next partner. It's all of that and so much more that really leads to a deeper understanding of their audience and how to move them to that next step forward. Tell us sort of that, that process that you and Tim and the management are sort of involved with and how that might develop over the next 12 months. Now you called that out an interesting point of, as you think about it, more, it has to be more than a merger. If all we did was take two great brands and cultures and teams and mesh them together, we have failed. We have an opportunity to really hit reset in this robust environment, listen more to our clients and understanding what are their needs when it comes to an agency today and build around that. And that's on the basis of an amazing group of people. And a culture and talent has been in place, but now we get to actually evolve that for the next gen and make sure our talent is also embracing new opportunities, that we're kind of level setting our own approaches and simplifying as much as we can. And also figuring out what the role data can play in our day-to-day -day lives and our day-to-day -day workload and processes, all with the intent of getting closer to consumer insights and understanding that we can also flow through actual experiences with our creative partners.